Yeah. Look how the diamond bleed off my jet. Fresh in my white teeth. See the progress. I'm a stunner, stunner, stunner. I'm a stunner, stunner, stunner. Gene Dio responds to a woman accusing him of assault at Diddy's restaurant called Justin's. I ain't even know he had a Justin's. Just in? Wait, just in what? The fuck? For I ain't even know he had a restaurant full, but the dude is a billionaire, big boy mogul, so I ain't surprised, goddamn. Gene Dill being accused of assault fool? Oh my goodness, for I thought Gene Dill couldn't do no wrong. Juicy. We ain't gonna waste no time, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and go stream Pretty Brown. Out now on YouTube. Bye. S T A K T. Let's get it, baby. Gene Dill probably finna. Boy, you finna go off on it, bitch, boy. How you see this TikTok video of this woman accusing you of being at a restaurant when a woman passed out and disappeared? I, I don't know, man. I'm a little confused when it comes to the story, but. She I'm passed sure out and right. disappeared. I don't know. Cusin who? But this ain't Dragon Ball Z. Instant transition. Cusin who? What the fuck? Me? Man, listen here, huh? bro. Check this out, man. If a chick is on TikTok, YouTube, that her first Patreon. Place on TikTok. I'm crying. What, uh, what, what's, what's the other sites? Uh, uh, Facebook. What is it? Kick. LinkedIn. What's the other social media sites? Fiber. Man, help me out, bro. Three. Whatever social media site she space. on and she accusing me, all she going to get is practice. Do you hear me? Huh? All she going to get is practice. Practice how to be a good damn liar. But oh. what she is doing is this, brother. And this is why I know it's set up. Check it out. Oh, okay. I'm listening. Oh, my God. Spill the beans. There's victims out there that are real. Fact. And bro, I was just playing early. I heard a story. And anybody that listened to her story, they scratching their head and scratching their ass and say, how did she come up with that? Because it had nothing to do with Gene my D. Booty in a week. And if you give me a time, I'm going to tell you what she said. Can I just get a minute, man? Please. Can I get a minute? Oh, go for it. Have, you got all the time in the world. <laughs> she <laughs> said <laughs> I was, she was in Justin. And in Justin. Oh, it was this girl, you come in and they got couches right there. It was this girl laid out on the couch. And the all the security was around her. What she, what happened? And I think Jean Deal was there. I'm 99.9.9% that Jean Deal was there. Oh, uh, okay. 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 When she came back, all the security was gone. Wait, did he name just all the bad boy son? people was gone and the girl was gone too? Oh Lord. Then she went on to say that her pocketbook came up missing. And now she tells us that I was working for Justin's at that time. Wait, her so pocketbook was in the locker. The girl that was passed but it out mysteriously came up missing. Where well, she had to go home with the manager that night. And she ended up sleeping with the manager who the was about 20 to 25 years older than her. No wonder you passed out. Sweaty pussy ass. So, I'm scratching my head wondering, where the hell did she get that I was involved in her sexual assault? when she decide to go home with the manager mm -hmm. that was 20 some years old with her, no. been her 20 or 25 years older than her. So she just regretted and her sleeping with him. To snitch on his ass? Where was I at? This is ridiculous. Cause she just said the whole security left out the, the, the bad boy. Ooh. Everybody's security left out with Puff or they left out with the girl. Well, she didn't know, she didn't know the dynamics of Justin. She didn't know that Justin's had their own security. And nine times out of 10, the guys were armed, puffed and one guns in the in club and the armed guards and the guards that did him, they stayed outside because Roy ran Justin and whoever he had for security that was inside of Justin's and they wasn't armed. Was now, Justin's like fire Check dining, this out. Or was it like fast food type shit? Y'all let me know something. Which is crazy. She said that 
They found her pocketbook. She came back to justice them, uh, again. And from that point on, she had a relationship with the manager. <laughs> who was over 20 some years <laughs> older than her. That was her story, bro. But I want to tell this young lady like this. Because I don't, she says she a victim. And I don't want a victim, Shane. But mama, hey. I'm not responsible for you getting worms. I'm not responsible for you deciding to sleep with a man that's 20, 25 years older than you. Oh God, you don't want to spread your leg. What they got to do with me? And you definitely didn't see me in no Justin. I've been in Justin's about five times, and I know every time I was in Justin. I know every time I was in Justin, sweetheart. And it definitely wasn't that time. And it definitely wasn't with Puff on that time. So, your lies, you hurting real victims. Oh, uh, hey, fast. Your lies is looking and is there to plant doubt that half, at least half of the 120 people who say they was victimized wasn't victimized. Your lies, ma, is going to blow up in your face. Like it's doing with your story. Yeah, I ain't so, lying, dude. Right, I'm, I'm sorry. Man. And that's been a whole lot of years ago. And I hope you took care of your worms. Because Big Gene ain't had nothing to do with it. Sorry. Playtime is over. That's crazy, fool. I know it happened all the time, but just imagine, bruh. 20 years later, somebody come out the blue, all of a sudden, uh, this case or whatever blowing up, and somebody come out the blue accusing you of being linked to this shit. But you got me fucked up. I wasn't even there. You know what I'm saying? Well, I feel like it should be a set time limit on things like that. Now, nah, if you a victim, you a victim for it. That ain't nothing to play about. But, dude, if you don't seek help immediately, I don't... Bro, I don't care for you claim you were scared, you was in fear for your life or the... Bro, go get that help right then and there. You come out 10, 15, 20, 35 years later accusing somebody or something. It just look like you clout chasing. Are you just looking for some type of attention? Are you just trying to get a payday? Did you call the Diddy hotline? You feel me, fool? It just, bro, it, fool, it's a bad look, fool. Do y'all agree? Y'all let me know something out of the comment. But, uh, I definitely feel like, fool, if you experience anything like that, assault of any kind, goddamn, you should get help immediately, fool. Cause it ain't gonna get no worse than what it already is, you know what I'm saying? That that's beyond me though, bro. Uh, I feel like on these things though, it should be a time limit from when it happened to when you got a report. Definitely not no goddamn five to twenty years for you coming out the blue on TikTok. But who the, I don't even be on TikTok. I feel like TikTok is for little ass kids. I might post my music on there, whatever the case may be. But dude. TikTok? Why you ain't call the police? Well, it's real life hitting. You're emotional and you want attention. When really, you probably just got drunk in hell and you decided to sleep with the manager. You woke up, realized what you were doing, regretted your decision, and all of a sudden you trying to blame people. I feel like people though that lie about things like this though, fool, they should face the same backlash. Backlash. People that lie about stuff like that, fool, I feel like they should face the same backlash and perjury as what they accusing you know what I'm saying? What, what they're accusing the accuser of, fool, because that's not cool, fool. That, I ain't lying. It kind of make me, like, scared to even, like, fuck with girls now, goddamn. You know what I'm saying? Or women, that is. But, uh, fool, it's all in the same, goddamn. If, dude, I don't know, fool. It, it crazy, fool, because it could be based on so many things. They could want money, so they're going to they gonna claim somebody did this, that, and the third. They could just want to see you down bad, so they going to claim this, that, and the third. Oh, fool, they, you know what I'm saying? They just don't like you, and they just feel like doing something that they could ain't got nothing else better to do. So they'll claim this, that, and the third. You just like, bruh, I don't. Just even hearing stuff like that, fool, just make me want to isolate myself even more than I already do from everybody, goddamn. That's it for this video, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and go stream Pretty Brown. I know YouTube by STAKT. I'm going to go eat some boiled eggs. Hopefully, I don't have gas. Well, I'm see y'all next video, man. Big brr. Look how the diamond bling off my dick. Fresh in my white teeth. See the progress. I'm a stunner, stunner, stunner. I'm a stunner, stunner, stunner.